Developing right now at 6, a disturbing discovery. Police find a young boy inside of a cage in a Philadelphia home. And that is not all that stunned neighbors and police. Well, let's get right to it. Good evening. I'm Yuki Washington. I'm Jessica Cartelli. This is all unfolding in the Mayfair neighborhood. CBS News Philadelphia reporter Alicia Roberts is there. She has the very latest information. Alicia, incredibly disturbing. Jessica, Yuki, police do caution that this investigation is still in its very early phases, but they do acknowledge that what happened inside this home, describing it as tragic and simply unacceptable. A little boy whose mother locked him inside a dog cage. He was found naked only with a pillow and blanket. Now, police were called to this home along the 2400 block of Glenview Street shortly before 1 o'clock this afternoon. They were called for the report of a person screaming. When they arrived, they found two little girls partially naked outside. When they went inside, they found those girls' brother inside that dog cage. Police also tell me an elderly woman in a wheelchair identified as the children's grandmother or great grandmother, along with a 40 year old man identified as an uncle. Who is disabled? They were also both inside the home when police arrived. Now, in total, there are five children living in this home. Two were at school when police arrived here. We did talk to a neighbor this afternoon who told us he has seen DHS officials at this home before. He was there when police arrived this afternoon. My neighbor found him outside, came outside by themselves, half naked. So my neighbor put him in the garage, called, you know, 911. When officers arrived at uh, one of the houses on the block, they saw two girls, ages four and five, that were partially dressed outside in the rain. The officers were able to pick them up and gain entry inside of the property. And uh, once they got in there, they came upon a six year old boy that was locked inside of a dog cage. At this hour, we're told the mother is being interviewed by police inside the special victims unit. Now, the children were taken to St. Christopher's Hospital to be checked out. We're told physically they are okay. They will remain with protective services officials tonight. Police also tell us they are trying to reach the father. Right now, again, the investigation continues here. We're live in Mayfair. Alicia Roberts, CBS News, Philadelphia. Well, you can feel it affecting even the officers. Just awful. Alicia, thank you.